Welcome to Ascent. My name is Martin Fordham, and today I'd like to introduce you to the Smart Evaporator from Biochromato. The Smart Evaporator evaporates solvents in a very different way to a rotary evaporator. It doesn't replace a rotary evaporator, but it's complementary. But what does it do that's different? Well, as a complementary device, it offers much more efficient secure and safe evaporation in tubes or vials of any size. So how does it work and how does it do that? I'm going to uh, get my phone and show you a close up. So here you can see a top of the tube and then we have what's called a spiral plug. This is the core behind the idea. The spiral plug it's just that it is a plug with a spiral groove cut in the outside. And down the center, if I can hold it to the camera, it's hollow. Let me show you how that works in this diagram. So what you can see here in the illustration is the plug in a tube. We pull a vacuum through the center. The vacuum then pulls air in from outside of the tube via the spiral groove in the plug. That creates a vortex of air, or gas I should say, within the tube, pulling up the liquid to the side walls of the tube, creating a thin film and evaporating very quickly and efficiently. But because it's only at a very gentle vacuum around 500 millibars in in general as a maximum we don't see any bumping or foaming so your sample is very safe and as can be seen on the right hand side of this uh, page of the uh, brochure for instance dmf dmso and nmp are very efficiently removed using this technology more efficiently so than the rotary evaporator so it offers two advantages, evaporation in tubes and vials, and the ability to pull off those high boilers that are often very difficult. Let's show you how it works now um, in the flesh. So depending on the tube size you have, there are different sizes of spiral plug. Again, let me uh, show you those up close. So different sizes of spiral plug allow you to choose um, pretty much any size of tube for evaporation. Let's show you how the device works. So inside we have a, a small heating, heating chamber. This is full of aluminium beads for heat transfer. So it will fit any size of tube. Temperature control on the front. Currently I've got it set to 40 degrees centigrade. But you can set that up to 70 degrees centigrade with no issue. And then we have this very simple holder for the plug itself to drop in. We have a sealed chamber so we can control the atmosphere. For instance, if we want to have an inert atmosphere, we can do that using the chamber. Uh, now what I'm going to do is turn the vacuum on and show you a close-up video of the plug-in action. So at the front we have this simple control valve. And this controls the, the vacuum flow through the tube. We increase that, we start to get a vortex. And it's as simple as that really. It's important not to fill the tubes more than halfway as this prevents any materials escaping into the vacuum line. But here we're getting a very effective mixing and evaporation taking place. I'm also showing a slow motion version. So there we are, let's turn the pump off so we can talk quietly again. So the smart evaporator is a very simple tool to use and very, very uh, safe to use with this closure door 
doesn't take up a lot of footprint in the fume hood. Before I go on to the brochure information for you, just a quick introduction to the dry soon spiral evaporator. I'll be doing that in another video. It's using exactly the same technology under license from Biochromato. Um, but this is in a dry sin footprint. So we can do multiple tubes um, for those of you customers who are used to using our dry sin parallel synthesis blocks for heating and stirring around bottle flasks. So this could be very interesting. Another video coming up soon on that. Let me just show you on my iPad the brochure. As you can see here, you can choose the color of your smart evaporator. Isn't that great? You can have all sorts of colors. Most people like the blue, me too. And then of course, it, this part of the uh, brochure tells you about the evaporation and how the plugs work. And a little bit more information as well. We've got a lot of customers now using these with very successful results. So please go to our webpage, the links are below. Um, two links I'll put below, one for the brochure, one to the uh, web page itself. And you can find out more information there. If you'd like contact from one of our salespeople to find out pricing or more information, please send an email to inquiries at ascent.com. But once again, thank you very much for watching this kitchen video for Ascent. I'll be back soon with more information, more products very soon. Bye-bye.